are we? Hello, everybody, and welcome to episode 13 of Let's Play Final Fantasy 1. Last time, we, uh, we obtained the Orb of, of Water and defeated, and, well, not defeated, slayed the Kraken. This episode, we're gonna go and see what the slab we have is all about. So, unknown symbols cover the slab. First, let's go back to Melman. Where Dr. Oon was, or uh, Une, there. Uh, speak. Basically, if you remember right, his cousin told me he actually understood the language of the Lefinin, or the Lefin, or Lefin. I'm going the wrong way, aren't I? Okay, is this the right place? Relay Warriors? Yeah, yeah, Yes, okay. Yes, here he is. Look! The Earth of a Shot- No, no it isn't. Melamon was once a beautiful town. Actually, there's a now. Is this Dr. Oon? The sl a slab? This slab will lead us to solve the riddle of the light- The light finish! Now listen to me! Or light finish. Warriors, arrive the power of the orbs. Okay. Now, with- because he, we have that. Yeah. We now know the language of the light of the Lefane people. I don't know how to pronounce their name, so I'm constantly saying different names. Oops. I think it's Le Lefainish or something like that. Or Fainish. Lefainish. There. Finally. Okay. Okay. So the Northeast Continent. So on here. The northeast continent, over here, is late. I think late. Okay. Yes, this is right now Lathan. This is where the Finnish people are. But, as you see, it's surrounded by unlandable land. For a long place. So, take the land here, and travel through the forest in order to get there. That is a Tyrannosaurus Rex! Uh, they have 480 HP, don't drop much gold, don't drop a ton of experience, you can do 65 to 130, uh, damage. But don't have much defense. So basically they can, uh, and they're also very accurate. So basically what their gimmick is, that they just do a ton of damage. Now the now one thing we can do, because we are much strong, they have low defense, so we can basically kill it in basically one turn. Mage staff. Okay. If, uh, graph criticals, it's dead. Heal. I forgot to use the end. Again. Okay. And it's critical and it's dead. <laughs> Called it. <laughs> and that, and we successfully wiped out the dinosaurs. <laughs> the dinosaurs are dead. Hi, in level 2. Hi. Guys, it's almost there to actually max. He's a. Uh, it's almost there to 999. Uh, about 400 more points. About 400. So soon. Uh, Drone and Guai Sage 999. 999 is the uh, the stat cap. Also, I guess I need to go and teach him some stuff. I might go to the first city and stuff like that. Anyways, uh, Tyrannosaurus Rex. I'm just gonna spam attacks. Just head south. Okay, Frost Wolves. These have 92 HP and do an average of 60 damage per. Oh, wait. We already fought these guys. Whoops. So I'm actually liking how the CRT makes the sprites look. They smooth them out and basically add texture to them. But I can show you how. Give me a sec. Alright. Alright, I found out what the button is. I'm gonna turn off the shader. That's how the shader looks without it. Why don't we do the battle without the shader on? It's just to show you the difference. I much like the shader on, because it helps with, uh, well, things looking nice. But some people don't like it, so... If you want another graphic difference, that different. I also have a, a shader on that basically... Well, another shader. I know I have two. That basically changes the colors to be more accurate to an actual NES. How is my look? 
turn it back on. Bit of lagging, sorry. Go on, look at the look at the trees and look at the character sprites. And the texture them. They look much different. Basically, views. Kind of more cohesive. Anyways. Here is Lathan. Or or Lefine. There's oh yeah. Now that we have uh, the slab, we can understand it. We are the Le Lefinish. Only the bra our bravest sky became Skywares. Your airship was theirs. Alright. Now there isn't much to buy, but... Oh, the Light Warriors. The legend is true! Okay, we don't have enough gold for what we can get here. Oops. At the time of, of destruction, a legend was born. In 400 years, warriors with orbs will appear to save our people. Are you? Hmm. Until 400 years ago, we controlled the power of the wind. Is any of us to spend the castle there? Four hundred years ago, we had a advanced civilization. Our inter interest was the universe. And what happened? I wonder if our robots made up by our ancestors are still moving. I found a golem. We have passed with the legend of the generation to generation. We passed on the legends from generation to generation. What of 400 years have caused our memories to fade. The floating castle floats high in the sky, seemingly among the stars. I think it's, I guess it's our next destination. The floating castle, our ancestors live there. The Mirage Tower is the entrance. So it's not a mirage, it's a teleporter. That's what it appears to be. We knew that a great power controlled the fiends, while the five bravest warriors left, never to return. The power of the wind was taken by Tiamat, which if you, if you played D&D, you would know exactly what Tiamat is. Tiamat is the leader of the Chromatic Dragons, while Bahamut is the leader of the Metallic Dragons. Both opposites. Tiamat being the evil bird, like the, like, uh, the god of evil dragons. Which is also a girl, if I remember right. Our last five warriors left to finally cause the wind world's decay. We know they live, but as bats. So that's what the bats were, if you're wondering. <laughs> They're old warriors who transformed. We fought with Tiamat, but were unsuccessful. The fiend is now was now inhabiting our floating castle. With a chime, you can enter the Mirage Tower. And this is what we mainly came here for. Which basically, yeah. Now, here is one thing. I might spend time grinding here, because if you didn't know, these two buildings are, you know, what the heck, how do you learn that? Okay, over here, there's a little gap here. Make sure I don't want to lose it. And there's two shops here. This one has life too. And this one has nuke. Both of these are basically the strongest spell slot spells in the game for the white and black mages. The white mage basically gives you life too, which restores it, which can help person from KO and restore the life to full. This one is a nuke, the strongest damaging spell in the game. So I might spend some time grinding just to get it on the earth. Well, to get it. See you guys in a bit. All right, and we're back. Uh, so, one, one. Nah, well, what the heck did I just say there? Well, one, we leveled up once off screen. Sorry about that. For one, now, we have an extra seven level spell slot. And two, we have enough money to actually buy the two ultimate magic spells of this game. For one, sprint to the magic stores, go here. Who will learn to spell? Life 2 for Gabe. And for David, good old Flare. Or Nuke. Now, we just need to do some cleanup for act for other spells for our characters. Like, for instance, uh, get some level 1 spells for Gaius, and get some the rest of the, uh, of the level 6 and level 7 spells, and the rest of the level 8 spells. 
But she's like the last thing we'll spend our money on, really, if you're thinking about it. But anyway, we have the chime now. So let's, uh, yeah. So let's do the Mirage Tower. Because now we can actually finish it. Heal up. But first, also, let's go to a, uh, an inn. Okay. Just gonna kill them all, and sprint. Oh, crap, crap, it's nearly dead. Actually, you drink a potion, if you can. I'll use the healing staff, and I'll use the mage. Let's just fix it so we can both. There, we go. We know that doesn't heal much. It is actually some good healing, which is good. Healing and burn. Okay. I'm gonna run for this battle because it's not worth it. Anyways, let's go to north, do Crescent Lake. Go to the inn. Also, doesn't Crescent Lake have some spells we don't get? Yeah, we did. Alright. We can't afford them, but we, there is spells here. We can put sell some items for them. No, we can't do that. It's darn, I can't sell a Phoenix now. Just yet. Anyways, now we can go to, to Mirage Tower, which, if you remember, is all the way there in the middle of the northeastern continent. So, land here. I just have to find it. Run. And there it's a Mirage Tower. So yeah. Enter in. And yeah. It's not it's not a, a big dungeon. It has a ton of treasure. For instance, the first floor. That's a huge room. Full treasures. Anyway, here's a nightmare, we already encountered that one. But over here is, I can find it, the Badman. The Badmen are have two very powerful attacks, which are, well, yeah, damn it, like basically attacking twice. They also have high magic defense and high absorb, being pretty dangerous, and they can also appear in groups, which is their most dangerous asset. So let's use the regular things, and they're also, well, have no monster group, really. Play out. Just to focus on it. Why should I do that? Okay, I almost think another one of them, actually. They don't come around in. Oh, hey, one of the robots they were talking about. You found it, 888G. A feel helmet. Which, if we can find it. Uh, the heal helmet is sort of the heal staff. But except it takes the armor slot. Which I'm gonna give that to armor. See if I can find something to use uh, you could use the Seuss Gauntlet. I guess you'll have two of the holes. You know, graphing, you, ha you have it, because you don't really need anything. Over here is much gold. Much gold. The Vorpal Blade. Which, uh, or the Vorpal. Let me find this. It, technically, it's supposed to increase your critical hit chance. But, because crit rate is bugged in this game, it's just bad. Yeah, because, so, we're just going to ignore it now. Okay, Ow, 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 ow. Let's 
chain it down. Over here is the Aegis Shield, which is the best shield in the game for the warrior. If I remember right. Yes, I'm right. Often resistance to poison. Also, it's a reference to uh, the same shield that, uh, what's her name? Ah. Uh, Athena used in Greek mythology, which actually has the carving of Medusa's face in it. So yeah. Anyways, over here is a cabin. Darn you. I'll try the heal helmet. No, wait, it, it, you don't have it on you. Oh, yes, the bad men also do not have weakness. Badman, which helps fire. Ata! Oh! And I've been poisoned, of course I have been. Thundercats, oh! Badmen are weak to uh, fire, right? I mean, Catman. No, they have no weaknesses. But they poison, so I'm just gonna use a heal staff. Fire. Heal. Mage. Yatta. Party's gonna be screwed after this. Okay, punch. You drink a pure. No! Oh. Okay, yeah, the party's not messed up this time. Know yourself, Catman appear a ton of things. Are you the master? Nothing here. There is most obviously something there. Anyways, go down here. And it's supposed to exit, but what am I doing? Ah, oh, I should've I should've gotten here first, instead of... Okay, anyways. Go up. Do floor two. Which... Yeah, basically. I have to go around. Hello. Prefer not to be poisoned, game. Please. Basically, the trick is that this room is just a circle. Ow, 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 Meet the Chimera! Having four attacks, and, uh... Yeah, and also it has Cremate, which is basically a fire three. But it's also weak to ice. 
So basically, you just smack with your sword and hope it doesn't burn you to death. And also use ice. Instead of that, just use cube ice threes. Let's use an cube ice twos. Use an ice three. Okay, it's dead. Healing. Mm. Okay, it's dead. Punch each of his heads out. I mean, get leveled up. And did it too. Let's say hi to you. One of us escaped with the cube. He floated far to the west. That is actually pretty important. Because the cube is a very important item that we need. So, we can't do all the dungeon yet. Guy, hold up. And also graft. Our characters are much tougher now. I believe those stats. <laughs> yeah. Anyways, and here is more chests. But here is something we can't hold, which is probably an armor. Let's, let's drop... What, what armor is this? Ah, uh, okay. Okay. Ah, okay. So we are actually gonna drop the opal. Actually, no. Trade out the flame armor and drop the flame shield. So wait, let's fix it first. Because this is the dragon armor. The dragon armor is is very similar to the opal armor, having the same defense. But what the dragon armor does is resistance to fire, cold, and lightning. Visa being a semi ribbon for dice. Making it so he doesn't need all that. For selling that opal armor for, well, armor and money. Money. Here's a sun sword. Sun sword is basically something that we're gonna replace our ice sword with. So look at that. The Bubble Blade, I think, also can be used by anyone. So, if I can do this. Okay, no, never mind, I'm being dumb. Okay. So now the sun, a new sword, new armor, much gold. Nope. Now this chest is special. This is, in my opinion, one of the best items in this game. The Thor Hammer. The best weapon for the White Wizard. This weapon is basically the best hammer in the game. Now what makes it so good is it has a much higher might, for instance, 18 instead of like, the, like the, an 8 is had for most of the game. And anytime it's used, it casts lightning too, being a really good weapon for the White Wizard. Also, let's leave. Ah. Let's test it out, actually. Now we have two weapons. This will cast magic. Zap, 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 zap. Zap, 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 zap. So now we have Thor and Zeus in the same in the same world, which is pretty weird. You gotta think about it. There's a Zeus gauntlet and a a Thor's hammer, which means that both exist in this universe. Okay, the blue dragon. You're new. Blue dragons are basically have f powerful physical attacks and use thunder. They are, again, a chromatic dragon. But also they have a 100% magic resistance, by the way. Do not use magic against this guy. They will resist. So what you want to do is instead fight. Ooh, okay. Okay. I'm beginning to think I should have cast anti-magic shield. Or ant Enough tier the third floor. Another blue dragon. Hmm. Let's 
use a anti-lightning. If I have it. Anti-ice, anti-fire, anti-lightning. There we are. And just fight. Okay, never mind, we need it. Okay then. Focus the cop creases, because they're much more dangerous. That's that, and also the mage staff. The one cop crease. Fire. And then the ground. And Hopefully, next turn, defeat all these guys. Attack! Transfer operation requires a cube! Ah, crap. So yes, we cannot continue with, again, like I said, we cannot continue with the dungeon, because we need a cube. Now, I'll see you outside, because we literally cannot exit, because we don't have the exit spell. I'll see you at Melmond, or Crescent Village. See you there. Another encounter that I never, that I never showed in this area, the Vampire Wall. <laughs> because no, va because vampires were once a boss a while ago. Now they're a regular enemy. So, what's the easiest way to kill them? I think we all know where this is going. I really don't need the spell slots. Bye-bye! Ton of stuff for us. Anyway, 10,000 10, gold. Holy crap. Anyway, see you guys again. Another enemy that never showed. The guard. Okay, let me boot up the guard's character thing. Da -da 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 -da. They're a rare enemy that is most full of magic and physical attacks. But have... Yeah, they're, they're rare. So basically what you want to do is use lightning against them, because they they're weak to lightning. So what I'm going to do is, is, is use healing on you guys, and use the Thor hammer twice. That was not Thor, that was not Thor's. Okay then. That was a mage staff. But anyway, I'm healing mainly because... Okay then. Heal. I'm going to use the Zeus Gauntlet. Save, because... The helmet, and use the staff, and there we are. Wiped out the face of the map. See you guys then. Alright, we're out of the dungeon. Basically, what we're gonna do now is we're going because the next area has another mini dungeon. Ow! Craft, rip. Anyway, now it's time to use the life spell, I guess. What am I doing? Actually, why are we doing healing potions? What happens in houses? At least for a reason. Anyways, we're gonna go back to Melmud. We're gonna go on a huge trip for our old spells. We have all this money! One, we're gonna back here. We're gonna get the exit and warp spells. Basically. Yeah. We'll learn this battle. Let's get exit. And for David, let's get. Uh, okay, this was a little high spell one. Yeah, I'm missing only okay, two spells. Okay, then. David. Get rub and quake. Okay, 
Okay, we need to go where the earth is rotting. I guess I can tell where I'm going, if you're asking. Okay. The first starting town we also need to go to. That's what's going on in my book if you do any stuff. Uh, for instance, white magic, white magic, white magic. For Gaius, let's get Cure 2. Heal. Okay, can't learn that. Can't learn that. Can't learn that. Alright. Run, because it's way beneath us. Okay, that's not the right area. There. Go here for a level 1 spell slots. Nope. I don't want to go to the church. Gabriel. Get cure. Oh. Oh, Gaius. Get cure. Arm. Can't learn that. Can't learn fog. And we're gonna lose. For now we have a bunch of stuff for that. I'm just gonna go to the next area. Go south. Just gonna go east. The massive shopping trip from across the ages. So yeah, sorry for the super like fast movement. I just wanna get this done quickly before I have to end the episode. Gaius, lamp. Gaius, Invis. Gaius, Mute. Wait, did I just get a useless belt? Too late, I'm not gonna be using them much anyway, because it's kinda useless, but... Okay, can't go there yet. Okay, you're, you're just there. Okay, up here. I think this is a foreign area later. Nice little finish. Go there next. Just there. I smell good. Okay. One thing. First, they will tie spells. Yes. Go in here. And for David, get the exit spell, or the warp spell. Now we just need to get the rest of the level 5 spell. Okay. Magic, we need to get you a level 3 spell. We need, okay, we, no, we already got a level 3 spell for you. Okay, we just need to get you level 7 spells. We need to get you level 7 spells. Okay, we're level 7s. Level 7s, level 7s, level 7s. Okay, break. We won't have enough gold for it, but we almost have enough. Gaia. Okay, we, we're just not Gaia, so... I am learning the world map as I go! Okay, we have full seven spells, okay. Okay, you have... Tier 4. Okay, do I have 4? It's the wrong area. Magic! Yes, I do. Anyways, clear all the rest of the spells. Uh, ice 3, blind. Where do I get you? On ramp. Where are you? I'm trying to find out where you are. 
Oxyale. Okay. Ah, oh, we're just there! You. No need to. Actually, I could kill you, but. You are actually useless. Me in here. Okay. Blind for David. Do you have to yeah, I do have to sell. Okay, sec. Zoom zoom! Maybe there are no weapon shops here? Kill, 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 kill. That's enough. Do you want to let that kill? What that is? So what? Okay, help three. Help three is useless. Anti rub. Oh, it's a broken. Okay, enter up. Yes. Uh, now here's the thing. Help three isn't that useful because of the bug. Uh, <laughs> uh, uh, so let's get enter up. All right. That's all the spells we can get currently of the last of late spells. Full magic repertoire. Except for, well, except for a level 8 spell, which will probably be for the white wizard. Probably be wall, which we can get at Gaia. For 8,000. Or 6,000, actually. 60,000. Oh my god. Go to the weapon shop that I have here. Sell from Gaius the Ice Sword. Sell from Grass the Vorpal Blade. Sell from Gabe the Silver Hammer. Sell from David. Nothing. Sell from you, Gaius. Okay, nothing. Sell from Grass. Nothing. Sell from Gabe. Yopal armor. Sell from you, David. Nothing. We could get one more spell, technically, but why don't we do that after we get the next thing? Okay. Alright. Okay, we need to go back on ramp to on ramp. Which are just there, so. So basically, come back here. 
for me to go up the waterfall. Why do we leave here? It's just it's a much closer area. Hold on. Oh, there's a gator as well. But eh, it's not bad. Just smack them all on the side of the head with your weapons. Make much money in the Force hammer. And also a Zeus Scotland use. Zap. Zap. And slash. Now we explain gators. Gators are, are weak to lightning and have a. Uh, they have two very powerful attacks doing 40 and 84 damage. 42 and 84 damage. They are pretty dangerous, actually. They appear in big groups, making them even worse. Let's punch the gator right in his mouth. Hydra is not that big of a deal at this point in the game. You know, ironic being at a Hydra. Actually, this is actually a really good depiction of the Hydra, actually, looking at it. Anyways... You remember how it said it flew off somewhere? Well... Here it is, the next dungeon of the game. But we're gonna do that next time on Let's Play Final Fantasy. See you guys then. Have a great day!